I'm Dr. David Chen. Uh, my specialty is otolaryngology, also known as ear, nose, and throat. Prior to medical school, I was um, I was pretty much focused in the sciences. My grandfather was a physician. My father, he's trained um, as a physician as well. I don't know, you know, if they were trying to tell me that's what I want to do, but that's what I wanted to do, you know. I went to medical school at UC San Diego. And after that, I went to uh, University of Tennessee in Memphis for my residency training. Within ENT, there are so many different things that we can do. We deal with the, the ears, uh, nose, throat. We do neck surgeries. I remember one surgery where uh, we did uh, thyroplasty, where uh, a patient was not able to speak because one side of his vocal cords um, was paralyzed. And so during the surgery, we m pushed his vocal cord to the middle so he was able to talk again. And we were able to have him talk to us during surgery to make sure that he is talking better. So as you can imagine, as a medical student, how can you not be excited about that? I try to have the patients tell me what is it that they want. Um, oftentimes, as physicians, we know how to treat the illness. Sometimes we don't really know how to treat the person. On a daily basis, sometimes we forget that we're doing our job and the patient's actually getting benefits from it. But once in a while, they do tell you, my daughter is able to breathe um, when, when she's sleeping, or I can smell again because, you know, my sinuses are not bothering me anymore. They're so thankful that you were there to take care of their father, their husband. And to me, that's very satisfying. I like to travel abroad. I like to travel to places where there's some element of adventure. We went on um, the Inca Trail, where you do, you know, camping. You would hike for maybe 10 miles every day. I was in Nepal last year, Morocco, I, of course, I enjoy Europe as well. After tr coming back from traveling, you always look forward to coming back home because we have everything here, really. PIH Health is truly an asset to the community. When you take care of patients, you, you're not alone. You have a really good support staff. I feel thankful that I was given the opportunity to be able to help people. I feel thankful.